After turning an entire country against them, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have quickly become some of the most despised people in the entire world. Nearly everywhere they go, they are mocked and shamed and ridiculed because quite frankly, someone like Meghan Markle, a D-list Hollywood actress, a woke activist who somehow managed to parlay that into a spot in the royal family is still a professional victim at each and every opportunity. And when people look at her, when people look at this couple and imagine them actually complaining about their lives and the way that they do, uh, putting out these Netflix documentaries that are making them look like the victims when in reality, they're nothing close to victims. Somehow, people really don't feel too sympathetic towards them. And now, South Park's taking a dig at them. South Park rips attention-loving Meghan and Prince Harry over privacy demands. And if it was just a simple spot in South Park, you know, I'd probably laugh. I don't know if I'd make a video about it. But the thing is, South Park makes fun of everybody. We've seen that. That's why it's been on for 26 seasons, because they take shots at literally everyone. Well, apparently, Prince Harry and Meghan, after getting destroyed and roasted by South Park, they're not very happy about it. Prince Harry, Meghan Markle, mole legal action over South Park, quote, hurtful parody of them. Are you kidding me? What absolute pussies. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry seem to be very concerned about their celebrity status in America. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, who have been brutally mocked by some TV presenters after their Netflix docuseries, are reportedly consulting their legal team to take action against South Park's hurtful parody of the couple. The Duke and Duch Duchess of Sussex seem to be very concerned about their celebrity status in America. After being royally laughed at by the satirical cartoon, it shows how far they've fallen. And I would be surprised if there's any big name Hollywood celebrity actress or, you know, somebody like that who hasn't been mocked by South Park. Um, you look at Tom Cruise, he's top of the Hollywood world right now, being praised by everyone for saving Hollywood, saving the theatrical industry after Top Gun Maverick. He's got uh, Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning Part 1 coming out this year. He's been mocked by South Park plenty of times. It is what it is. It's, it's not that big of a deal, but... These people right here are very, very sensitive. Uh, they try to lie about everybody. They put out fake stories about everybody. They hire people to lie for them. That's what Harry and Meghan have done repeatedly. And now it looks like they want to take legal action against South Park for making fun of them. And uh, th this was the funniest part to me. We want our privacy. Stop looking at us while going on talk shows, while making Netflix documentaries, while making these appearances, pretending like they just want a life in private when in reality, all they want is attention. Take a look at this little clip. I don't think we can play the entire thing because again, it's copyright, but we'll play a little bit of it. Uh, South Park dropped a Prince Harry and Meghan Markle episode this week. There's talk of them trying to get it blocked, even legal action. Good luck. South Park plays by their own rules. They're finding it hard to go on. All Canadians, that is, except for our first guest, the prince and his wife. We want privacy. We want privacy. <laughs> we want privacy while going on talk shows. It's almost like this parody hits pretty close to home. Makes it pretty easy to make fun of them, doesn't it? Hey, thanks for having us on the show. It's so awesome to be here. It's great. So let me start with you, Sam. <laughs> and of course, uh, we, we want to talk about this. This attention is so hard. Isn't it true, sir, that your questionable wife has her own TV show and hangs out with celebrities and does fashion magazines? What are you suggesting? <laughs> this part is good. Well, I just think some people might say that your Instagram-loving bitch wife actually doesn't want her privacy. How dare you, sir? My Instagram-loving bitch wife has always wanted her privacy. And you know what else? To hell with Canada. We are leaving. We'll go find some quiet place where we can be normal people. Come on, wife. We want privacy. We want privacy. And that was just a little bit. That was just a little snippet from this episode. And the idea that Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are so butthurt about this, and their reputation's ruined. It's destroyed. It can never recover, ever. That Netflix docuseries that they put out trying to get out their side of the story, it got roasted. It got destroyed. They are now more unlikable than they were when they first put it out. And that was all them. That was them. They controlled everything about that. And now it looks like they want to take legal action against South Park for doing what South Park does and making fun of people. Pathetic. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle continue their downward spiral. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Smash a like button. Subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell for notifications. Share this video out there. And I'll talk to you later.